method has been evident on the glass. Really getting after it and being physical. This OKC roster does have some excellent building blocks to work Thinking with. back to the first half, I'm wondering, did he take a low percentage shot? Everything efficient. Tandem at the one and the two. It's Gideon Gilgis Alexander. Lugans Dort out there with Alexei Pokashevsky. And it's Wigbound. Offense, defense, no matter what, he's attacking the glass. Nice move. Ooh, and a nice layup by Giddy. Giddy's got his third basket of the night. Well, the talk at halftime must have been a good one right now. Three straight buckets to start the quarter. Ooh, it's stolen. And here's the fast break. And there's the slam. Dunk to finish it off. And Dort has a nose for the bucket. All right, so about the Pelicans. What has been holding them back? Well, B.A., it's definitely not the offense, especially with the healthy Zion. If they can... Yeah, they've collected an impressive number of steals so far, using fast hands to force some turnovers and then scoring on the other end. Well, if we add another thing to it, it's about the urgency they've played with. I mean, you look at the eyes of these guys. They're focused, want to get up tempo, and that's helped. Passed by Donovan Mitchell to a ready shooter, and his focus as a distributor has really improved. Here's Giddy. One up, one down. Two points with his first shot this game. And once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. But I think defensively, that is not... He's certainly been a consistent piece of their offense, averaging about 14 and a half points a game. Clock is at three. The tray. And the thunder, another three. The defensive pair in the post, Mobley and Allen. Darius Garland is out there with Mitchell. And it's Levert in at the three spot. It's good from long range. Giddy's got 11 points. Now this is going out of hand. They are rolling. Giddy against Garland. Dort picks to Wiggins. On the wing, Giddy. He's got 11. And here's Gilgis Alexander outside. Score the basket. He really gives this team a physical presence. Oh, I like this guy, B.A. I mean, very strong, very aggressive at both ends. He makes a lot of hustle plays. I mean, that's a nice find by Murray. He has the height to see the floor, and his awareness continues to grow. And the Hawks going from the East. They're playing great team basketball. It's good movement and sharp, crisp passing. And that one's good. Giddy. Terrific play. This is why Dort grabs the miss. Oklahoma City has got five of seven threes to drop here tonight. Giddy with it. And it's Young picking him up. Dort for three. Buries it from three. Inexperience on the roster right now. Keeping the core here, yeah, but experienced players to fill out that roster. Guys, the Nuggets. And that game against Houston. This is a game that they are expected to win, but sometimes those are the kind of games where you get a little bit sloppy and start looking ahead. Either way, they'll need to put in tremendous effort to walk away with the victory. In the offensive low. Last quarter of play, about two minutes in now. Fires from deep. And the Thunder, another three. Oklahoma City has gone 7-15 from three-point range tonight. They're not afraid of that shot. Wiggins outside. Outside, Dort puts up a three. And again, Oklahoma City with the triple. It's been this way since halftime tonight. And making a statement. Really good work all around for Oklahoma City. The big difference here was accuracy from three-point range. And once they started sinking shots, they really stretched out the D and created other opportunities. And anytime they got space, they seemed to just knock down another triple. And with this.